Someone requested me to do Spinosaurus again, so here it is. Evolution of Spinosaurus Egyptiacus. 1915. It started off literally a T-Rex head. I mean, the pronated wrists are just usual at this point. It's got that tail dragging, of course. It walked super upright with that sail over here. And then, if you look at the 1970s to 1980s depiction, shout out to this guy, by the way, we'll see that the skull has been elongated and the sail has become more pronounced and not as flat as the other one. The general body build is the same, however, it's less upright now. This is literally just Jurassic Park 3 Spinosaurus, though it still has the pronated wrists. We actually have a tall, lanky body, as you can see here. The tail also got much less thick, and as you can see here, the skull is incredibly elongated compared to the other two, and also just thin in general. Now we have the 2008 to 2010s depictions. It's still got that sail over here. However, it no longer has pronated wrists. It's got a few more colors. It's got a crest up its head as well. We're starting to see that the Spinosaurus is differentiating from other Spinosaurids, like Baryonyx. Now we have the 2014 model, as you can see here. It keeps that crest, and the sail became much more of a fin. Much more of a sailfish fin, in shape, at least. It was also believed to have been a quadruped. Well, in the 2019 Amazing Dino World. The tail, still the same. However, we're moving on to 2020 now. It keeps its skull and everything else. However, it is now believed to have had a paddle-like tail, which helps it in swimming. And now here's the grand finale, the Spinosaurus in 2025. The body and the eel-like tail now have more separation instead of just being feeling glued together. And I feel like there is webbing here as well. Most importantly, it's got a whole lot of colors that, you know, make it look more like a male. But of course, these creatures aren't really as vibrant in reality, but whatever. This is still fine. But anyways, what do you guys think? Let me know in the comments down below. And subscribe if you want to see more content like this.